Shelby County reported 374 new COVID-19 cases today. LeBonner confirmed two pediatric deaths connected to the virus over the weekend. Hospital capacity is shrinking. So tonight, the city of Germantown says it will now mandate employee vaccinations. You can look for this case to head to court. In announcing the employee vaccine mandate, Germantown City Administrator Patrick Lawton said, we are all public servants and our collective efforts are vital to the health and well-being of the people we serve, the residents of Germantown. If one of our departments is understaffed due to COVID, he said, we cannot deliver the services our residents expect and deserve. Lawton and Germantown Mayor Mike Palazzolo say employees must be fully vaccinated by September 6th. But back in May, the Tennessee legislature passed a law prohibiting such an order. There's a school of thought out there that it wasn't drafted correctly. And so I think Germantown um, probably believes that they can uh, get a judge to agree with them that it doesn't prohibit them. And not all in Germantown city government are 100% on board yet. Alderman Scott Sanders told Action News 5, I was not consulted, nor was I involved in deliberations to implement this plan. I'd need to consult with our legal counsel before making further statements. So the conservative suburb of Memphis, the first to test the water now in the continuing fight against COVID-19. It certainly was the legislative intent that uh, cities, municipalities uh, could not um, require employees or anyone to be vaccinated. All right, and some viewers have been asking if Germantown or any other employer can mandate what is an experimental vaccine right now. Well, tonight the FDA announced it is ramping up the timeline to fully approve Pfizer's vaccine by early September. Live in studio, I'm Joyce Peterson, Action News.